<laughs> what? <laughs> the ending. Oh, I thought you meant because I saw what J-Lo no, about no, the No, no, like, no. The ending that of that preview where the trailer just looks funny. Okay, so you can talk about J-Lo's life. Let's hear it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I don't know what I'm going to really say about her life. I just know whenever I think of J-Lo, the first thing that comes to mind is that, what was it, 2001 Versace dress that she wore to the... Let's see, P. Diddy was her escort, so what would P. Diddy get invited to? Probably, what's the music awards? The Grammys. There we oh, go. Duh. So many. What was J-Lo for? The Grammys. I think it was the Grammys. 2001 Grammys, and she wore that green Versace outfit, remember, and it just went completely V-cut yeah, yeah, yeah. all the way down right above her navel. No, right underneath her navel. And, like, she had tape, and, like, every, and, like the whole entire back was on completely, and everyone's like, Whoa. That was like the most, that was like the, such a huge fashion forward moment. Like no one had ever revealed that much. She yeah. was like, she wasn't even like embarrassed. She's like, hey, what's up? <laughs> oh yeah, it's taped down, don't worry. <laughs> I feel like that'd be you. you I don't be, know. You'd be risque. That's real risque. I mean, there, I'd, have to, I'd have to start doing a lot of crunches <laughs> if I was gonna do something that risque, but. You come to the gym with me. Oh, thanks. You're welcome. No, I know, I know. That, that's a true comment. Thank you. <laughs> I will get back into the spirit of working out. Yeah, Don't you, you worry. We used to go all the time. You were like, you know, Miss, I'm going to wear my <laughs> ball cap. <laughs> you would wear your ball cap, and then you're like. Beer shirts. Yeah, your beer shirts or whatever, and then you would do the stare thing. Stairmaster. The Stairmaster. It's the best on them thighs. Yeah. Glutes. Get some nice that was, glutes. You would always go. I know. It was always me, you, Mary. That's how, that's, that was like another like common little bond. Then we mm -hmm. all went at the same time. Yeah. Nice things. How dare you? You ruined it. Mary doesn't go as often anymore either. <laughs> I'm not the only one. <laughs> well, you're like, it's not just me. It's not just me. At least I've Storm stayed. under the bus. At least I've stayed with the gym this whole time. This you whole have. year. You have. I've lost muscle tone, though, because of it, so. Yeah, and remember that picture you showed us at the, like, the first, first day, day of school? Yeah, like I haven't really gained freshman 15, luckily, but definitely lost the muscle tone. I think I get like little baby fat areas now. Ugh. Are you examining your arms now? Yeah, now I kind of, you know. Yeah. <laughs> I, I don't know. I must have this natural born cut. You see it? I see it. I think I was born like that. I think it's just a trick. I wonder, I wonder what the viewers think of your arms. Look at them, guys. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Stop. Okay. <laughs> yeah, J-Lo. Remember all, the, remember all the men that she's dated too? <laughs> there was P. Diddy, Puff Daddy, Sean. I don't know what he even wants to be called. He's got He's so just many Diddy names. Now. Diddy, okay, yeah. And then she was with Ben Affleck. Remember Benifer? Mm -hmm. That yeah. was huge. That was, yeah, that was a big deal. And then Mark Anthony is who she's married to now. Yeah. But then she married that bald guy who was a backup dancer for her. Really? Yeah, real quick. Then they divorced. He was real shy. That was like in, forget one. And then she dated somebody else, too. Or she was married before that. She was married to some Latina, or Latin dude also. Hmm. Not Latina dude. Yeah. <laughs> well, weird. <laughs> I don't know. I, uh, I just remember her, like, that, yeah, Jenny from the Block stuff. Yeah. She looks so good, though, still. Yeah. She still, like, got the body and everything. I know. It's so unfair. Twins, too, on top of it all. I know. <sighs> Celebrities. Pfft. What the her, heck? She, I think that she's just so pretty. Yeah, and that badonk a donk. <laughs> Sorry, I just had to put it out there. I mean, everyone, everyone established, everyone knows J Lo for her assets. So just had to put it out there. Start singing. She got a donk. She got no. A donk. She got. She got it. <laughs> she got it. She got it. <laughs> that's what people. That's what Austin always does. <laughs> yeah, really. All right. Now to the DVDs. DVDs. All right. This one is called Crazy Heart. Rated R. The DVD release date is April twentieth. It's directed by Harriet Walter. Plot says a faded country music musician, music musician, oh yeah, country music musician, that makes sense, <laughs> is forced to reassess his dysfunctional life during a doomed romance that also inspires him. Main cast is Jeff Bridges and Maggie Gyllenhaal. Jeff Bridges? Jeff Bridges. Who won the Oscar? Hmm? Who won the male Oscar? I felt like it was him, maybe it's not. I don't remember. Wasn't it for this movie? I feel like I recall something. Yeah, like it was. Yeah. yeah, he did. Good for you, Jeff. Yeah. Good for you, Glenn Coco. <laughs> <laughs> mean Girls. <laughs> what, what about uh, Maggie, sister of Jake? I know. They look ident like one 
She is him in female type. Really? You think so? They have the same young face. But they look not, no. What are you talking about? <laughs> face I just made yeah. is disgusting. <laughs> Oh my gosh. It's so disgusting. I just don't think they look that much alike. I think me and my brother look more alike than them two. I don't know. I can definitely tell if they're related, though. Can you tell that me and my brother are related? Yeah. 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 There's some people, like Bobby and his sister, too. They look really alike. Really? Yeah. I've never seen her. Real like. Hmm. Mm hmm. Huh. I really look like my siblings, too. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Only child. Doom you, world. Doom you. Okay, wait. Doom you. <laughs> this, we just need to now talk about the best movie coming out. Oh, my gosh. All right, <gasps> go ahead. Avatar. Bow, bow, bow. Rated PG-13. It will be out on April 23rd, and it was directed by James Cameron, the director of the Titanic. Cameron. The director of the Titanic. It's about a paraplegic marine dispatched to the moon Pandora on a unique mission, becomes torn between following his orders and protecting the world he feels is his home. The main cast is Sam Worthington and Zoe Saldana, who is in the, the, the what's it called? Losers. The Losers. Yep. Good. Good. Yeah. Glad you Shush up. I completely forgot. It was quick. Sorry. Yeah, you're too busy with all that whale. Yeah, I was talk. too into that. Yeah, I, you know, <laughs> true. I definitely want to see oceans. So I'm, I'm really hey, sad about that We're not even done talking about Avatar. Calm yeah. yourself. Avatar was amazing. Yeah, it was. And I, I believe the end would have made, like, if I wasn't cruel and mean and tried not to cry, I would have cried. It was Aww. sad. I didn't cry, but. It was sad. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> it was sad. You better cry. You listen up. You cry for everything, Jules. I know, but I don't cry in this. this I was just too in awe with all the blues, with all the blue colors and all that, like. Legit, the scenery was just so incredible. Like, I didn't even care about the plot of the movie. <laughs> You're just like, wow. yeah. I was just like blown away by um, that l the tree, that one big tree and all oh, the pink yeah. flowers that fall. And trade market this. I'm trade marketing it. Didn't we talk about this before? Trade market. Yeah, like trade. This is gonna be my idea. No one can steal it. The <laughs> scenes in Avatar with that big tree and those pink willow blossoms. I'm creating it if it doesn't get created. You know how they do that wallpaper that sticks on like you can make one wall look just like like New York City they've got like that roll that goes down and you can look like you're in Paris like with the Eiffel Tower oh, or something yeah. I'm making an avatar world and you add blue lights you add, or black lights I mean to the side and it all glows just like that world and I'm doing it so <laughs> no one take my idea <laughs> I'm doing it yes huh. no one take my idea unless a company has already come out with it but that would be awesome that needs to happen why don't you do something about it I who make things touch happen. With? Ikea? <laughs> I don't know. Ikea? I'll make it happen. Ikea, for sure. Ikea. That way it's at a good discount. That way it becomes a big, huge phenomenon. That's all I have to say. So. <laughs> <laughs> all right. You're such a dork. That's oh, gonna... my gosh. Shut up. That, all right, everyone. That's your ticket to Hollywood. We'll be seeing you next week. I'm Jules Sheehan. And I'm Victoria Griggs. Bye. Bye, guys.